French President Emmanuel Macron has uncovered plans to present France's first since forever service of truth keeping in mind the end goal to battle deception on the web. The draft law, intended to stop what Macron calls control of data in the run-up to races, will be bantered in Parliament Thursday and afterward put energetically amid one year from now's European parliamentary surveys. The law is simply the brainchild of Macron, who claims he was focused amid the 2017 battle by false bits of gossips that he was gay and had a mystery financial balance in the Bahamas, bits of gossips that ended up being valid. AFP reports, under the law, French specialists would have the capacity to instantly stop the production of data esteemed to be false in front of elections. Social systems would need to acquaint measures permitting clients with hail up false reports, pass their information on such articles to experts, and attempt open their endeavors against counterfeit news. Also, the law would approve the state to take remote telecasters off the air on the off chance that they were endeavoring to destabilize France. A measure apparently went for Russian state upheld outlet RT specifically. Censorship? Dash. European governments have attempted to work out how to react to the phony news wonder, not minimum after allegations of Kremlin intruding in France and the US presidential vote that conveyed Donald Trump to control. The British government has set up a phony news unit while Italy has an online administration to report false articles and the European Union is taking a shot at a code of training that would give rules to web-based social networking organizations. France needs to go encourage, however not similar to neighboring Germany, where informal communities confront fines of up to 50 million euros, 58 million dollars, under a questionable law which fault finders say is excessively draconian. A few adversaries fear French specialists could utilize controls in the new law to square humiliating or trading off reports. It's a stage towards control, said Vincent Lanier, leader of France's National Columnists Association, the SNJ. He named the bill wasteful and possibly hazardous. The administration demands measures will be incorporated with the law to secure the right to speak freely, with just reports that are clearly false and that have circulated around the web remarkably with the assistance of bots, brought down. Diminishing flexibility of articulation isn't a thought by any means. Despite what might be expected, it's to secure it, said Culture Minister Francoise Nissen. Leaving counterfeit news to spread would be an immediate assault on news coverage, she contended. In any case, for Jerome Finoglio, article chief of La Monde Daily Paper, the enactment conveys too huge a danger of stifling data in the general population intrigue. Races ought to be a period of awesome flexibility, these are periods when critical data rises, he stated, noticing for instance the phony occupation's embarrassment that torpedoed the battle of presidential leader Francois Fillon a year ago. We ought to be stressed over a tyrant administration winning force in France later on and the strategies it may utilize, he said arbiters of truth. Others stress the law could reverse discharge by giving additional validity to reports named counterfeits by the specialists among those persuaded the administration is out to conceal reality. Fabrice Leboyne, who shows media learns at Sciences Po College in Paris, predicts calamitous outcomes of the enactment which he says is as of now observed as a law of oversight. It will just fortify a feeling of resistance towards the press and legislators who are now extremely ruined, he cautioned. Far-right pioneer Marine Le Pen, whose devotees stand blamed for spreading counterfeit news, is among the individuals who have talked against the bill, asking, is France still a majority rule government in the event that it gags its subjects? The EU, as far as it matters for its has said it wouldn't like to make an Orwellian service of truth and won't administer on counterfeit news. In France, there are additionally inquiries concerning how the law will function by and by. Judges will have only 48 hours to lead on a pressing solicitation to bring down a report. Legitimate master Vincent Curran says the law is blemished and superfluous, as well as unsafe for the peace and decent variety of open verbal confrontation. It will transform judges into authorities of genuine and false, said Patrick Ivno, a media history teacher at the Sorbonne College. Concerning conceivably kicking out outside media, 
Finoglio is profoundly awkward with the thought, not minimum given that Le Monde is hindered in China. I can't safeguard measures under which it's viewed as ordinary to hinder a wide range of data since it's viewed as near a remote government, he said.